Okay, I'm gonna say what time is it, and then you're like, coffee time. Okay, what time is it? Coffee time. <laughs> That's so fucking stupid. I hated it. <laughs> we are slaves. We're like, we're so, we're so not down for it. We're like, coffee. <laughs> Good morning. Oh yeah, morning dance. We're all in this. Okay, guys, just poke your toe. Okay, I'm fine. So basically, today we're gonna be making a coffee with the Keurig. I've never used a Keurig before. Actually, that's a lie. I have. Let's get right into it. We're gonna go like this. Then we're gonna go like this. Then we're gonna go like this. And then we're gonna go like small one. This. <laughs> Follow me. Let's go get the almond milk. Come on. Oh, let's go. <laughs> um. Sorry, I got distracted. Hi. Um. Okay, almond milk. Let's go back. Let's go back. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. Yes, oh, yes. Breakfast is served, bitches. Oh, that will sit, beach. Proceed to the root. Okay. Proceed to the root. Okay, shut up. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> I don't even know what to say about that. I've been listening to my oldies playlist on Spotify. It's a good time. I'll leave my Spotify in the description. Because I am doing this road trip alone, I was forced to sing the male and female part of Don't Go Breaking My Heart by Elton John. Jake Paul. The... We love him, his content. We love him, we love everything about him. He's a king, and so is his brother, but we don't have a conspiracy about his brother today because we just don't. <laughs> Jake Paul, five million on YouTube in six months. Never done before. He's a absolute YouTube beast. He's doing great for him all, for all of them. He's doing great for all of us, all right? And he's really inspirational for me and for other little kids who need guidance. And I'm basically a fetus, so I also love him. This one is one of the most convincing photographic conspiracies I've ever seen in my life, and let's just hop right into it. Jake Paul, here he is. Just take a little look at him, look in his eyes, kind of, uh, I don't know, get familiar with his face. Good, now let's take a little look at Herman Munster. If you don't know who Herman Munster is, he is, let me actually read what the fuck he is, a fictional character in the CBS sitcom The Munsters, aka like an old show that old people watched, but I'm actually not old, I'm in fact actually a newborn child, if you can't tell by my appearance. My dad actually brought to my attention that Jake Paul looks strikingly like the dad, Herman Munster, or is it Herman or Herbert? Fuck, I don't know, Jesus Christ, I didn't watch the fucking show. Herman. <laughs> Now, if you look at them side by side, I mean, they really do truly look almost exactly alike. But when it gets truly, truly frightening. Anyways, AirPods, yes or no? The short answer is yes. The long answer is fuck yes. Anyways, amazing investment. I am so glad that I bought them. Probably one of the best purchases of my life. Sick, right? The only thing that happened to me that was a little bit disturbing, I was chilling at my desk. All of a sudden, I accidentally bump one of them out of my ear, which is a rare occurrence. Usually they just stay in your ear all the time and never even like budge. That's the word. Is it the word budge? Never even budge? Yeah, they don't budge. But sadly, it fell out and it fell into my shirt. First, I took off my hoodie to see if I could like jiggle it out somewhere. Couldn't find it. Then I took off my shirt. Mind you, I was alone, so this is not weird. Well, it's still kind of weird. And couldn't find it. Then I think that they might have fallen into my pants or like into my pocket because I was wearing sweats. So I pulled down my sweatpants. Next thing I know, I'm fucking naked and I still have not found my AirPod. I soon realized that it had been on my seat the whole time and I just had failed to check to see if it was on my seat and there it was. That's the only negative experience that I have had with an AirPod so far and honestly, is that really detrimental? No. You ain't a hope. Get up on my what the? Good morning, guys. It is 11 a.m. Not doing so good. Actually, no, I'm doing good. Lately, I've been waking up at like 8 a.m. because my mom thinks that it's good when I wake up early, so she's been waking me up every day at 8 a.m. and telling me, Get your fat. Get your ass out of bed. Oh, I am a hygiene goddess. My hygiene is absolutely out of this world. Completely spectacular. I smell so good all the time all the time. I shower twice a day. I shower, you know, fuck it, I shower four times a day. Morning, before breakfast, after breakfast, after lunch, after dinner.
I shower like once a week. And now I'm gonna make some decaf coffee because I feel like it. So suck my weenie. Got Thumbnail. It. Just kidding. I would like. Really? No. Uh Well, I'm gonna shower and then hit the haystack, you know what I'm saying? So, I guess I'll just see you tomorrow. Good morning! I am so sorry about my behavior. Let's take a selfie. One, two, three. Marla, I'm gonna break in this. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh my god, we're so cute. Party. Good night, people. <laughs>